nearing victory. Welcome back everyone to another episode of Halo 4 Forge Map Collection. This is number 2 in the series. I'm Spiral Knight 13. Unlike the last episode, I'm going to be playing with one of my good friends, Coolest. We're going to be on, playing on a map that was created by myself, uh, Soundwave, and Burnout. Alright, the map, it's, uh, it's, it's called Sewer. This map was created on Erosion at the bottom. And its game type is Oddball, or as I like to call it, Interference. Alright. This is uh, a game pretty much based, you know, just entirely on using jetpack, balance, and pipes. Note, only four people can spawn in uh, the game. So, it's only a four-player game. However, it is fun while those four people are playing it. I know, here I am. I've got a lot of lag. I really suck at this one, though. Yeah, coolest beat me. Uh, you know, he really beat me. He was really good on this one. Yeah, I just can't get up there. <laughs> yeah, this is one of the reasons that you're gonna need a jetpack, just in case you know you reach an area like this. There aren't a lot of areas like that. They usually have, uh, you know, gravity, uh, gravity volume zones, but. On that one, I just thought, you know, for those people who uh, use jetpack, get a small advantage just to that little area. So I thought, you know, why not? Oh, come on. Yeah, I killed him. But anyways, this is a really cool map. Like I said before, you do need, uh, you're probably going to need jetpack. It is in one of the classes. I have default classes, so you're going to want to use uh, this game type and map. I'm going to be putting this on my file share after uh, after I post this to YouTube pretty soon. It should be on 7th. Not sure. Anyways, yep. So I have made a lot of um, what I uh, I designed this so that it would uh, the oddball would randomly be chosen to one of the I think there are about 7 oddball plates. So it'll randomly uh, go to that. There is no specific orders, meaning no one can have a good advantage over another unless they've played the map before. It is one of those maps where if you've played it before, you do get a small advantage, but... I mean, hey, you played it, so... Ah, oh, dang. Yeah, Coolest is probably going to get the oddball right now. Now, if you've noticed, I have put... Um, I think they're like called special effects. I completely forget the name. Anyways, one of them was Juicy. The other one, I think it might have been Next Gen. No, it wasn't Next Gen. It was one of the others. But anyways, it was Juicy and uh, it possibly another one. Where did he go? Oh, he fell. Did he? Oh, yeah, apparently he did. Okay. So I'm going to go over here. Yeah, um... Another thing I said you really needed was balance. One of the reasons you need balance, yeah, if you uh, if you jump from one pipe to another, it is very easy to miss like that. You really need to know the map well in order to, uh, you know, play well on it. It is a uh, free for all match. It isn't like two v two or anything. I mean, it's four people. It's not really big, so I didn't want it just to be 2v2, so it's a free-for-all. Uh, this should consist of about two rounds for about 150, 200, not sure. I think it was 200, but don't quote me on it. Oh, and there he is with his... Ah! Oh, yeah. That's why you really need to know the map well. Anyways, I'm like I said before, I made this with two other people. Hope you guys enjoy this map all. Yes, I am going to put it on my file share. So. Oh dang, no. Man, I really need to get used to these gravity volumes. The only reason I didn't want to use trait zones was because um Otherwise, you wouldn't know where you know where you have lower gravity. This way, 
you know, you're not completely lost if your brain's making new to the map. Alright, so now I'm gonna try to catch him over there. Ah, oh, dang. Alright, I'm gonna have a lot more of these maps. Um, I don't think I've said- I don't think I said this on my last video. But I've, uh, I've made and I'm gonna make more of them, but... To start it off, I've- I've been making three maps on each of the three forge maps. The reason that they call them forge maps is because, uh, you can create structure parts or, you know, uh, parts that, uh are specifically designed for that map for erosion you can only use the pipes on erosion it's a structure part you know but uh... yeah but, uh, anyways so like i was saying before i'm gonna make three maps on each of the three forge maps I already told you what, uh, how you would consider a forge map, a, a forge map. Um, but yeah, so, uh, the three forge maps, if you haven't figured it out, they are Ravine, Impact, of course, and Erosion. Alright, I've already done one for Impact, two down, uh, or, you know, one down, two to go. This is my first for Erosion, the next one will be Ravine. Um, I think I'll do my, uh, Daybreak, Daybreak, uh, map, it's, yeah, I know, there's a, uh, map in one of the later map packs called Daybreak, I had no idea, so, that was a major coincidence. But anyways, it's a Dominion map, so, I hope you guys will enjoy it whenever I post that, I'll probably do it pretty soon. I think I'll present it to you in custom games because that's a lot easier if you see for all of you who, you know, haven't seen Dominion yet. Ah, dang. Yeah, I'm really stinking on this one. Alright guys, but this is pretty near the end of my video, so I'm just gonna sorta uh, stop talking a bit early and but before I go, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. And check back for more of the Halo 4 Forge Map Collection videos, alright? over. 